Good morning, Bradley Charbonneau here from Lycoma, and I am going to walk through setting up a, pay, a quick, quick and simple page template to try to prevent code breaking within the WordPress editor. So, for example, I'm in here at Camille Cusimano, and her blog page, which is technically a WordPress page, just shows this list of posts from her blog category. The way that currently works is I go over here to the page and I see in the code, in the content, there's just this uh, coffee to code plugin that shows a get recent posts from a certain category, category 17, and that's what does the list. But I would like to not use this because for one thing, if Camille comes in here and breaks it, it needs to be fixed, and then she can't so easily get in here and edit. Also, I'd like to not use a plugin if I don't have to, and so I'm going to use some WordPress uh, core code instead of a plugin to make this happen. So I'm going to go over here to Dreamweaver and make a new, there was one I was just doing, I'm just going to duplicate that one and I'm going to call it, I'm going to call it the, uh, I'm going to call it blog. And all I'm doing is here is the content under the content, before that ends, I am making this this code here calls a category, I'm going to make it 17, the last 99 posts from category 17, and I want it to show the title and make a permalink, and you make it bullets. So I'm going to save this, we'll upload it to the site, then I'm going to go uh, use the page template for blog, which is now there. Update the page. And ideally, this should be doubled. It should be that one from the coffee to code. And then under it, it should have the same thing again. There it is. So, same thing again without using the plugin. And now I can clean this up. So, now I can just get rid of that code. Camille can come in here and write an introduction, for example, to her blog. And I can. Deactivate a plugin, which is always nice. So there we go. Now we're back to the same thing we had. We're using one less plugin. We're cleaning up this space so we don't have to be careful of breaking code. And that's it for today. This is Bradley Charbonneau from Licoma using page templates to help not break things. Bye bye.